Hey guys, it's Adriana from The Backpacker here, and today I'm going to take you on a little journey with me to get ready for my ski trip to Colorado. The first thing that you will need are base layers. Base layers are typically synthetic or merino wool. These ones from Patagonia specifically are synthetic, so they're going to be super soft and quick drying, and for someone who runs hot, these are the best option for me. Next up are ski socks. These are smart wool and they're made of merino wool. They're gonna be nice and padded, temperature regulating, and great to wear multiple days without wash. I am absolutely in love with Farrah's Kate Parka. This jacket is so thick and fluffy and warm that all you need is a base layer underneath. Same goes for their bibs. They're super stretchy and also super flattering, which to me is kind of important. Both the bib and the jacket have really nice pockets to store a whole lot of your little needs. Next up, we have gloves. I prefer mitts just because they keep my fingers a little bit warmer than gloves do, and these Dakin ones come with liners already, so it's the perfect option. You also can't forget a fleece headband from Turtle Fur, and also one of their skull caps to keep your ears and your head warm underneath your helmet. They are both thin enough and still look cute. Probably the most important thing on my skier's checklist is a neck gaiter. Uh, this one is fleece. It's great for skiing or hiking. Anything out in the cold, it's going to keep your nose nice and warm. I also had to grab our backpacker skiers checklist um, because I will be forgetting some things and this just ensures that I won't be forgetting anything. There are a lot of goggles, but the main thing to remember, like with these, is that they have a lens that you have to pop out. So I prefer sticking with these right here. These have a magnetic chroma pop lens that is easy to remove, so you can change from your day lens to your cloudy lens very easily. And you get to see wonderful bright colors. Helmets are really important here. So Smith makes a couple different types of helmets. Um, I definitely prefer the one with their MIPS system on the inside of their helmet, which provides great energy absorbing impact protection, just so you know your brain is safe. I'm gonna grab this beautiful cream colored one with the MIPS protection, and we're gonna bring them over to our little pile that we've started. And now I can begin checking off all the things I already have off of our skiers checklist. You also don't want to forget an audio system to listen to music while you're on the slopes. This is where I remembered I need some gooder sunglasses. They are no slip, no bounce, and polarized. And also some sun bum chapstick with SPF 30. Sun protection is really important on the slopes because the sun's reflection is super intense. Now I'm making my way back to the shoes, my favorite part. Um, definitely these Sorel boots right here are my absolute favorite. They are a beautiful cream color as well, go well with everything. They're super fluffy and they're going to keep your toes nice and warm. I am grabbing a ton of these hand and toe warmers. They work super well and last for up to 12 hours for me. And I've finally finished my skier's checklist. Happy skiing, everyone.